Bonjour tout le monde, my name is Diane. I'm the American behind this channel here on YouTube where we talk about everyday French life and beyond, and also the living abroad lifestyle blog, also called We in France, that I'd love for you to check out. Uh, today we're gonna get right into a short video from the supermarket chain Aldi. They're a discount store, they're German in origin, but they're in 20 countries all around the world. And uh, be sure to check out some of my other supermarket content from here in France. Um, I've done a favorite a souvenir video as well and they might be of interest. So we're gonna get right into it. All right, everyone, so I've pulled into the Aldi parking lot and uh, if you're not familiar with the store, uh, one of the reasons why I wanted to do a video from here, because one, it's a discount store, which is a contrast from the other supermarket videos that I've done that I'll link above and down below in the description. And second, because it's a store that exists in 20 countries, about 10,000 Aldi stores throughout the world, um, and it's becoming more popular in the USA. So to that end, uh, for those of you who are familiar with Aldi, uh, you can kind of contrast what it looks like in France with what uh, it looks like in the U.S. One thing you'll notice right away is that this store is bright and airy, very modern and clean, and that is because it's new. It opened about a year and a half ago, not even, so it's in great condition. And you'll notice everything in Aldi is set up in France, more or less the same way that it is in the USA. I've been to one store where my parents live in Florida and it looks similar, but you're gonna see some differences as well. And since I've only been to one store, I would love to hear from you, uh, those of you in other countries, uh, just what looks familiar to you and what looks different down in the comments. Now, something you'll see are Trader Joe's products. Yes, here in Aldi in France. And while they don't have any of the good products, in my opinion, you'll see different nuts and coconut bits and things like that. And that is because Aldi and Trader Joe's, despite it being a Southern California company, they're owned by the same parent company, uh, Albrecht Discount. So that's a German company started in 1948, but they do own both Aldi and Trader Joe's. So that's why you're seeing some Trader Joe's products here. And I wish they had the everything but the bagel seasoning. I love that from Trader Joe's, but nope, won't work in the French market, I don't think. And here in the fruit and vegetable section, unlike a recent grocery store video I did where you had to weigh your own produce, it's marked here that you wrap your stuff up and then they weigh it at the register so you don't have to do it yourself. Aldi France has a nice bakery section with all kinds of things, donuts, viennoiserie, bread, uh, and everything you'd expect. Uh, I don't believe the dough is actually made in the actual store. It's industrial, but it's baked in each individual store. And prices are reasonable, and from what I've purchased, the quality is good if you don't have time to go to an actual French bakery. Something I noticed about Aldi France is, of course, the products here in France are suited for the French market. So there are a bunch of products that I found and loved in the U.S. I'll show you one in a minute. Uh, that I cannot get here in Aldi France and vice versa. There are products here such as the fondue uh, or fondue in English. In French it's la fondue, uh, which you can only get in France. So I'm going to run through a bunch of shots now and just let me know if they look familiar or not and uh, if anything looks good. Here we have some amazing little cream desserts. Of course they're available in Aldi in France. Crème brûlée. Uh, what is that? A petit pot de chocolat and a panna cotta.
Okay, let's take a quick look at some of the frozen foods. Aldi in the USA, they have this amazing frozen cauliflower crust pizza. It does not work on the French market, so you can't find it here. I'm so bummed about that because it's excellent. So the desserts look pretty good, although I have to say I've never tried them. They have little mini desserts and then the bouchette that I talked to you about in one of my previous videos, some eclairs, cream puffs, that sort of thing, all reasonably priced. So I'll have to try them and get back to you on that. They even have a small book section for kids and adults right here next to the flowers. I picked up some white tulips for $1.99, but first we have a popular Oprah book and Jamie Oliver translated into French, of course, and you'll see that a lot, a lot of French titles for books that maybe you know from home. They had some beautiful poinsettia flowers for Christmas, and now there are some succulents. I think I see an orchid behind there, and of course the colored tulips, all reasonably priced, so I try to pick up some flowers when I'm here. And Aldi wishes us a happy holiday season and new year on the way out, and there I am with my flowers, so that's it. All right, everyone, that wraps up my video today from Aldi in France. Let me know down below if uh, you've seen anything interesting or anything that looks familiar or different from your home country. And also, if you've purchased any of my merch uh, that's linked down below, I would love it if you tagged me on Instagram and shared a photo of whatever, whatever you've purchased. Um, that would be really great just to keep helping me to spread the word uh, and build on that. So, And also, if you're not on Instagram, feel free to email me the photo and I'll post it on your behalf that would be really awesome. So thank you again for your support on that. And also I have a newsletter uh, that's linked down below. And uh, when you sign up, you get a free guide that's about 10, 11 pages uh, of do's and don'ts that tourists need to know about when they come to France. So sign up below. Thank you again for being here, everyone. I really do appreciate you. And I'll see you right back here on We in France soon. Salut!